Introducing Flux Context. The new revolution in in painting. Now you can use it in Forge WebWi with as low as 4 gigabits VRAM. No matter you want to make changes in single image or you want to combine two pictures they're nothing better than Flux. And good thing is you can use this on Kaggle. If you are new to my YouTube channel subscribe it and press bell icon to stay updated. Watch my whole video. Well let's see how you can use this on Kaggle. Click on Kaggle link in my description to go to Notebook of Context Flux. To use it go to Notebook Options and choose P100 GPU and Files and Variables in Persistence Options. Make sure you see Internet option and it's turned on. Click on three dots at top and start session. After session start run installation cell. After installation run both checkpoint cells one by one. Run V and text encoder cells. You can either run with Ngrok cell by providing Ngrok token or with Pingy. Run Pingy cell. When you see local URL click on Pingy URL to launch Context Flux in Forge. Click on Extensions and Install from URL. Go to main page of Context Forge and copy its Git URL then paste in URL and install it. After installing go to install then apply and restart then close this window and stop pingy cell. Run pingy cell again and launch forge webwe again. Choose Flux and Flux Context Model in Checkpoints and V and Text Encounter. Click on Context Forge and expand it.
upload picture and type prompt what changes you want to make. Click Generate This will take 4 minutes to complete. Each prompt take about 4 minutes. You can also combine two pictures together. Type prompt and generate picture. I hope you like this video. If you got any question or request comment. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Take care.